I have benefited a lot from dairy farm assistant and uh, there before I had no knowledge the ones I, the one I have today I have been uh, educated or have been trained on how to handle my animal I have been trained on how to manage my fonda there before I had to sell my animals because I didn't have enough fonda Today, I have uh, supernapia, which we have planted uh, about two acres. I have also managed to have rosan and uh, kuyu grass, which are doing well now. The other area is uh, now the training that we have gotten of hygiene, keeping of silage. And even hay, we have been, even ratio, the formula of feeding our animal. There before I had a challenge, and a big challenge, of maintaining my production of milk. This time I've improved. It was the last time I know I was at 30 something. This time I'm at, at 40, and there are two other animals which are going to come by 20th of this, of this month. So I'm expecting to go higher than the, the position I am today. I'm expecting those two animals will give me maybe about 20, 25, so I might go to 70 or 80. This one has uh, been made possible by the training I have undergone. I had uh, several challenges there before, which probably I would ask or maybe I would request that farmers will get assisted in. We have been lacking seeds, especially the maize for silage. Already I have been trained how to keep the silage. Already I have. I've kept several, several tons. And uh, we didn't have maize in, uh, in the stores around. We were lacking that seed. So we had to plant seeds which are not satisfied. So that's a big challenge in our area. The other challenge we have it is managing our animals because of the drought. If there could be any assistance where we can have, maybe we can be assisted to harvest water. We become farmers who can use water during drought season so that at least we can have our farming all around, all, all, all season. I think we can be very happy. About two years ago, we had a drought around this area. And uh, I had managed to have eight hyphas per degree. I wanted to, uh, to train them or to have them in my farm so that I can increase the production of my milk, targeting 200 liters. Unfortunately, due to the challenge of fodder, because when I finished my silage, uh, I just saw that the only option I had was to dispose them. So I sold those hyphas with a lot of pain because now I had kept them to retain them in my farm. But I disposed of them because I had no food. I wish to thank the company very much indeed for partnering with the Moki farm. Because really, we who have undergone this training, we are very grateful. And our prayer is, may the company get assistance even elsewhere so that at least they can enlarge the number of beneficiaries like us. And we would even request, put a request that the training continues, a continuity of the same service. We would want that very much indeed.